let's start the uh, the horror show. <laughs> 1990, 18th of August. I think the finish looks a little bit like couples. Uh huh. I'd been playing golf for about a year and a half, maybe two years at this point. I first picked up a club in in '88, so I wouldn't have played wouldn't have played that long. I think I'm gonna watch it again. I don't know if it's a mad axeman at the same time with a couple's finish. So. Yeah, I kind of like it though, nice flow to it. I think we could have worked a little bit on this posture. We're sitting down quite a bit there. That looks lazy. <laughs> lazy, yeah, it's three years later, you're supposed to progress. Yeah, I don't know if we, well, I'm certainly taller. I've grown a bit, that's for, that's for sure. Uh, yeah, no, that, that was not a step forward. That feels like a step backwards to me. Skip 1993, I guess at that time when when you're getting a little bit older and, and uh, yeah, just getting used to, to your body changing, I think is a big key. Uh, you can see a lot of players sometimes struggle at, at the times when they grow a lot. And uh, yeah, I, I, I certainly could have worked a bit on my posture. I was certainly sitting back and, and uh, but then I thought it looked, looked very slow. It didn't look like I was very, Aggressive in those shots, so uh, yeah, I think we could have we could have put a bit more effort into it. <laughs> yeah, I can remember this was my first win on the Challenge Tour in 2000, and and I was struggling this week. I uh, didn't have a great week swing-wise, but I. Uh, I just found a way to get the ball around the course, and uh, I still like this one better than the uh, 93 version, though. It's uh, it's a little bit uh, more fluent, and uh, yeah, still room for improvement, though. This is going to be from the Ryder Cup at uh, at the K Club. Yeah, that's more like it. This is this is more more what we're used to to seeing, and and that's just a controlled kind of a punchy six iron or something like that, controlled mid iron. I started working with my uh, current coach, Peter Cowan, all, all the way back in 2001. We, we certainly did some modifications. I certainly recognize my swing a lot more here than I, than I do from 1990 and uh, 1993. Yeah, so this, uh, this clip here would be from a couple of weeks before I win the, the Open Championship. So this is BMW International in, in, uh, in Germany, in Cologne. It's uh, it's kind of a little movement forward, and then that, that really starts the, the the backswing or the takeaway. Um, I don't even know if that was something I was actually working on. That just kind of snuck in there one way or the other, shifting into my right side. Uh, and uh, yeah, I was I was certainly starting to hit it quite nicely around this time, and then, and then carried on to win the Open a couple of weeks later. I think this is in this is in the Middle East. This might be in uh, this might be the Saudi International. Now the funny thing when it comes to swings, I actually didn't feel like I was playing particularly well at this uh, this point. But when I look at that slow motion swing, it, it nothing stands out to me as not being uh, pretty decent about that one. So it just shows you how you feel sometimes and, and what it looks like and. Kind of, you can have mismatches, and, and one day you feel great. The swing might not look any different compared to what it did yesterday, but you kind of feel different every day. And uh, I think the uh, probably the best one is the 2006 one from the K Club. So can I just get that one back, please? I think that was the best swing out of the out of the uh, out of the lot. So looking forward to uh, to see if you agree.